You can see the bugs are starting to come out now. I don't know, well maybe you can. They're starting to swarm around me a little bit. Um, this is mid, mid to late July, I mean, sorry, June. And, oh, oh man. <laughs> <laughs> I, w I was running this lure near the surface and it's kind of just cruising across the surface and this uh, this uh, oh there he is oh man nice and this uh, oh did I lose him oh, oh man he was a good one too. Oh shoot! Is that always how it is? But I was running the lure right, right across the surface, and the uh, the grayling jumped out of the water and tried to get it coming down, and uh, he he missed it. So then I cast right out to the same spot and uh, hooked him, or at least I hooked one, and. Uh, he was big. Oh, got him. Look at that. Almost as soon as it hit the water. Now that is what I like about gray lane fishing. Oh man, he is spunky too. Oh, wow. Again. Again. Twice in a row. Got off. What is up here? I don't think there's anything wrong with my hooks. Wow. Man, that was a big one too. Shoot. I doubt it's gonna hit a third time. Oh man. Thought I hooked something there, but it might have been a might have been some weed. I'm almost wondering if there isn't a hole right there. It's hard for me to believe the same fish would hit three times in a row. I'm not saying it wouldn't happen. I've had trout do that. But uh Usually, after they get hooked a few times, they decide that they're, you know, they've had enough of it. Oh, there you are, you little sucker. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know what it is. That one spot out there, I keep hooking fish right over in that one spot. I'll hook them and then they just get off. I don't get it. I, w <laughs> I was really happy because I had, oh, there he is again. Oh, there we go. Let's see if I can set the hook this time, man. Usually I don't like to set the hook because it can, you know, damage their mouths and stuff. But I keep hooking something over in that same area over and over and over again. I wanna see what it is. Well, he ain't bad. He's probably been hooked so many times he's tired out. Nice looking fish. He's decent size. That's a nice fish. I don't know if that's the same guy that I've been constantly getting or not. Well, there's the beaver. I don't know if you can see him in the background or not, but he's cruising across the lake there. I noticed the beaver here are uh, very curious. They like to kind of come, check you out, see what you're doing, you know. And uh, generally speaking, they don't seem to get that afraid of you. I've actually had them come up fairly close to me and just kind of check me out, see what I'm doing and everything. And kind of saying, hey, what are you doing? Well, actually right now I'm in a beaver. Oh, nice hit. Boy, that sucker hit hard. Did you see that? 
Man, that thing hit hard. I can't tell if this one's very big or not, but boy, he's pretty powerful. This one's gonna give me trouble when I get him in. I have to get him tired out just a little bit more. That one actually hit so hard, I was wondering if it was a small northern. This particular lake, oh, there's that beaver right there. I don't know if you can see him running across or not. Um, this lake has got a, a natural population of grayling, northern, and what is the other one that they got here? I think whitefish. The only thing I've caught in this lake so far is northern. I mean, yeah, grayling. But I know there's northern here. Oh, this is a nice fish. This is a good fish. Look at that fish. Really oh. nice scenic road, although a lot of it's dirt. There we go. Oh, man. That's a monster. Oh, that was a pike. That fish was a pike. Dang it, I would have liked to have gotten him. Look at that. You know how I know that was a pike? See the end of my line? There's no lure there. Shoot. Darn, I would have liked to have gotten him. Oh well, right? Time to put another Time to put another lure on. I want that big fish. There is a big fish out in that hole. I've hooked it at least once and I want them. <laughs> Boy, it is just so, so gorgeous out here. I'm gonna try a slower retrieve and see if that, oh, there we go. See that? See these grayling, they like that slow retrieve. I have not been using a really slow retrieve here because the water is so shallow, but they like that. And they also like changing up, changing up your retrieve. There we go. Come on in, baby. Oh, he's not bad. Yeah, okay, okay. Just hold, hold on here. Dang it. Sometimes they can get pretty scrappy. So he's a good one. 